This is the front of the building, where you can see all the boarding over the windows. The building now resembles a prison, and has been turned into a complete eyesore by Yorkshire Forward. There are no fire escapes now out of the building. All of them have been covered up by Yorkshire Forward. Only this single exit entrance now exists. This used to be a fire escape to the outside. This was the outside exit. This and two other fire escapes have been sealed off. The 24-hour security guards have been complaining about the danger concerning all the fire exits which have been sealed off. This has resulted in some of the guards being very negative towards me. How are you going to get out of the building if there's a fire? That's what I'm going to do. If there's a fire here, how are you going to get out of the building? Past the nearest window. Which window? Any room. You tell me a window that there isn't a 60-foot drop. Well, I'm not well, I'll advise you to go and find some way of getting out of the building. Because there isn't a way out of the building. Except for this door. Look in front of you there. The windows is steel barred. Your only way is to go up these stairs and to jump out of the first floor window. But that's the only way that you can get out of this building, by smashing that window. Also, the studio clients entering the building felt extremely uncomfortable and intimidated, not only by the unsightly building, rubbish and rat poison, but also the varied articles left by the guards at the door in case of trouble. Studio clients, particularly new ones, are very reluctant to reuse our services once they are told about the lack of fire exits and particularly once they hear that the only emergency exit from the building is a 40-foot drop through a window. This has also affected many degree students wanting their year placement here, where some universities and schools will not allow them to come.